Hey what's up guys, my name is The Channel. I don't want to take up too much of your Sunday. This is more of like a little quick announcement as to what is happening this coming week. This coming week is Game Engine Series Week. So for those of you who have no idea what this is, and you would be rightfully so because I literally made this up like an hour ago, what I'm going to be doing this whole next coming week is live streaming every single day, much like I did with Falcon Week, except this time working on the Game Engine Series. There are a few reasons why I decided to just go all in and spend the whole week working on this one thing, namely the fact that I am uh, feeling like I'm a little bit of a mess right now and I feel like live streaming for a week straight is kind of like having a real job and thus will motivate me to actually be productive and do some work, but then on on the other hand, I feel like the Game Engine series is at the spot where, you know, we've got a lot of tedious work to get done, namely like the UI for all the components and, you know, rearranging just the basic hazelnut editor stuff. So I want to kind of just sit down and try and nail through that as much, as quickly as possible so that we can actually just, you know, shove past that and begin working on some more interesting things for the Game Engine series because I feel like... I feel like we should be getting to the point where you can at least make a little 2D game, but there's still a lot of work that needs to be done to get there, and I really want to get there before the end of this year. Now, because this is the Game Engine series, which is like a video series on YouTube, this isn't like Vulcan Week where it's just purely live streams, I will actually be recording one episode of the Game Engine series every single day, Monday to Friday. Now, I'm going to be spending a lot of the time outside of that in the live stream preparing for the episode, making sure that I build up a good kind of amount of code so that I know what to actually do in the episode. And then the episode will just be more or less like, you know, me actually writing the code that I've probably already written before and played with before, but in the form of an episode. So if you, if you can't catch the live streams and you don't want to see me for hours probably, you know, tinker with code and get the UI just right for certain things, that's totally fine, you don't have to because onto this YouTube channel I will be uploading every day except it'll be like 24 hours after the stream, so starting from Tuesday I guess every day this next week there'll be a new Game Engine series video up on this channel. Now as always live streams will be on twitch.tv slash the channel, I'll leave a link below to the schedule as well, it's just twitch.tv slash the channel slash schedule. That will contain the schedule for all these live streams and you'll see it kind of in your time zone. So if you're not sure what time this is going to be, it's going to be Monday through Friday 10 a.m. Australian Eastern Daylight Time is the, the target starting time for all of these live streams. If you don't know when that is in your time zone, that's okay. Just check out that schedule using the link in the description below and it should basically translate into your time zone. Now finally, if you're not able to catch these live streams at all, but you really want to watch the actual live streams, and they will be saved on Twitch for subscribers, so you can subscribe on Twitch. Or even better, you can support me on Patreon, there'll be a link in the description below, and you'll get access to all of these live streams as well as the entire backlog of all of my live streams that I've ever done. And of course, that's the best way to help support me and everything that I'm doing here on this YouTube channel. And finally, if I was to leave you guys with a bit of a meaningful message to this video, I would say that if you are struggling with any kind of development work or any kind of creative work that you're doing, especially now during like lockdown, wherever you may be in the world, then really, really consider live streaming what you're doing. It doesn't necessarily matter if you have a large audience or not. I think that live streaming is a really good way to force yourself to kind of be productive, not get distracted and actually power through certain tasks. And I think that in the past it's helped my productivity a lot and that's why I'm excited for this next coming week because I know we're going to get a lot done and I know it's going to be a blast. Hope you guys have a good rest of your weekend and I will see you hopefully tomorrow. Goodbye.